were clear. I gave her everything. And she threw it away. She's a threat. There is only one way this ends. I know what must be done. Knowing and doing are different. Not long enough. We need some rest. What I need is justice for my family's murder. I'll be one step closer once I catch the snake named Umara. One of the conspirators on the list. You're dead. Let's wait. See what happens. You're dead. You're gonna get cut down or shot. No, Omada's mine. It's too late. He's dead. I heard him talking about a letter. He might still have it on him. I'll check the bandits. See if they're holding anything. This note bears the same clan emblem that was on the list from the inn. This was a setup. Whoever killed your family, the old Omura here to silence him. The coward is covering his tracks. Judging by this note, it's clear he's desperate for money. He must not lead a wealthy clan. Or he has no clan at all. You think my family's killer isn't a samurai? Maybe he wants to become one. Start his own clan. And he's scavenging the corpse of Clan Araji to fund it. Few people have the ambition for such a plot. I can use this. Narrow my search. First, get some rest. This hunt is killing you. Until I find the man responsible, there is no rest. I still have work to do in Kushi. Find me when you can. way to go right there. This might be the second to last rank though. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, yeah, now we go do the thing with Nadio. She was here. Yes, my lord. The Mongols stole our sacred Buddha and rode off toward the coast. We'll return the statue and save this temple. Not even your brother could keep that promise, Norio. What was that about? My brother fell to a Mongol blade. Enjo the Guardian dies, and these monks are willing to give up everything. They're cowards people. 
Enjo feared nothing. He wasn't even 20 when he saved this temple from bandits. Now it's up to us. I fear Nario might end up becoming an enemy in the end, and that would be sad. Because he, he's starting to get angry with everything. We need to find the Buddha and return it to the temple. The monks said they took it toward the coast. We can pick up their trail. Well, we don't, Mario. You're angry. How can you tell? You're not talking. Ha! It's that monk. He doesn't know the whole story about my brother saving Kushidera. I heard Enjo acted alone. That's the legend. In reality, he ordered three of his bravest monks to challenge the bandits. A distraction. A sacrifice. They died in battle, but only after giving Enjo enough time to flank the bandits and save the temple. Lord, over there. So What happened? I was following the Mongols and begged them to give back our Buddha. Where did they go? Out of the forest. To the hill. May your next life be more peaceful than this one. The Mongols will pay for the agony you endured. A Mongol camp. The statue must be there. First, we punish them for attacking the temple. Like this? No! Oh, I hate these guys. I hate. Oh, you still- Oh, I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive. We became the guardian for this statue. It's priceless. Probably survived many such attempts. How many more people have to die protecting it? You want to let it be stolen? No. But the temple is filled with treasures. It provokes greed and envy. Lord Shimura brought me to see it when I was a boy. I was sure the sculptor must have met the Buddha in person. When I was a boy, 
My family traveled here to make an offering for the new year. That's when Enjo and I decided to become monks. I used to know what I fought for. We fight for a home. Maybe so. Sensei Ishikawa. Yeah, we have to travel to the Black Dime Merchant to get there. One of Tomoe's training camps is around here. Whatever you want. I'm not a thief. Uh, everyone knows you're attacking caravans. The ghost and the demon sensei. Sensei Ishikawa? That's a lie. I've heard you myself. Heard us? When? Not long ago. Tearing up the road like starving wolves. Sensei Isko and I being blamed for highway robbery. Head north. Find out who's responsible. later and I got a bit of a headache but I took some medicine for that why are you always under attack when I come to find you the whole like past week where I could have had like good chances I could have been past this stuff for a while but the past week has been very great you're welcome, Sensei. Oh, things are kind of okay now, I guess. But things definitely were not doing well. I also had not been feeling very great recently, so. You're the ghost! What happened here? His caravan was ambushed. Lots of attacks lately. People say you're stealing supplies, or sided with the Mongols. Rest easy. I'll discuss this with Lord Sakai. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. I caught up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. You'll put an end to that. Rest here. Eat the food I gave you. And wait a while before you leave. Thank you, Sensei. Show me where he was ambushed. And fuck them ladders, Sensei. How did you find me? Someone heard a convoy being chased. People avoid the roads because of Tomoe. When I caught wind of a merchant chancing a supply run, I followed. Why would Tomoe attack supply runs in Kushi Prefecture? There's no strategic importance. No. But Kushidera Temple inspires people. Would be a Mongol effort to break morale here. You don't sound convinced. I think that's part of it. Not all. Tomoe betrayed everything I taught her. Then she betrayed me. And after me, her 
home. I'll hunt her past the horizon if I must. Is this where the caravan Here's was the attacked? Convoy. More victims of Tomoe. Let's see what we can learn. No other survivors. Japanese and Mongol arrows? Of course. A message. It's a warning to the people of Kushi. From Tomoe. From Lord Sakai and Sensei Ishikawa. No travel is permitted on these roads. On pain of death. Crude, but effective. They took off down the road. And we'll find them. This is the last time Tomoe and her men will ambush anyone in Kushi Prefecture. What? I thought we were gonna go on foot. There's a lot of follow the tracks in this game, but it's not really. It doesn't look like I would have been doing it anyway. Just follow him. Uh oh. You said hurry. No time to scout the camp. Now who's rushing in with his Hakama half tied? Why is she here alone? I'll cut her loose. Here. Uh, I'd, I'd be careful. I bet this is an ambush of some sorts. Please help. Yeah, I don't trust you. You'll be killed in the seconds, I'm sure. Shot. Oh no. No, please. No. We're here to help. She said. She said. Tomoe? What did she say? She said I could live until the samurai came. Oh, I told no. you. On the ledge. Oh, I told you it would happen. I told you. I warned you. I knew it would happen. Tomoe set a trap for us, and we walked right into it. I spoke with her two days ago. Tomoe? The captive. Heard her talking about a Japanese woman she saw with the Mongols. I asked her to find out where they were camped and report back. You did what? It could have gone the other way. We'd be standing over Tomoe's body instead. You talk about what it means to be a warrior. How Tomoe undermines that. But you and she are the same. You expect us to be perfect. Your uncle, me, Masako Adachi. But only a child expects perfection of his elders. Finish your thought, Sensei. We all carry weapons. We all choose between life and death. And you're too comfortable with that power. And if I weren't, I would be dead. And so would you, Ghost. Not everyone can be a samurai. But we're all killers. We still have a camp in Otsuna to deal with. You made a good point right there. You know, I really wanted to get Ghost of Tsushima done before, like, you know, October 5th, but I don't think that's going to end up happening, you know? I think that, um... Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen, because I'm not sure how many main missions there are, and I still have to explore the whole third area, which, that actually only took me a day and a half to explore the first area, the second area, which we're in. 
I don't know. I, I mean, I guess we'll find out, but I only, you know, do my recordings on, uh, Tuesdays, Fridays, you know, days when Zach isn't on, but sometimes on those days, you know, something gets in the way, and then I can't really do anything. But, we're gonna see how far we get today. I'm gonna have to get back home and do the editing. At least I am free from some work that I was doing before. That gives me time to rest. Masako, what's wrong? A man named Kachiwara recruited the men who killed my family. His name is on the list. He lives in this prefecture. That monk knows where, but he won't tell me. Junshin means well. I'll talk to him. Junshin, it's good to see you. And you, Lord Sakai. Lady Masako and I are looking for Kajiwara. You know where he is. She accused him of terrible things. I fear for his life if she finds him. Asako has good reason to believe he recruited the men who killed her family. He would never do that. He is a humble fisherman, a loving husband and father. I think she is blinded by rage. Jushin, I need to talk to him. As long as it is just talking. It won't. See that right there? <laughs> that ain't talking. It's obviously the cutting of hands. Take the road from here to the coast. Kajiwara's hut is on the beach. Well? We'll take the road to the coast. Thank you for your help, monk. Peace be with you, Lady Masako. I can't imagine what you said to Junshin that I didn't. He doesn't even try to hear me. It's like talking to a stone. I think he's afraid of you. Afraid? Why? You can be intimidating. In our world, that is not a bad thing. We're hunting a cruel and vicious man. He was a retainer for our clan. Dependable and skilled, but quick to anger. We excused his behavior until the day I caught him beating his wife and daughter. The coward! Hurting his own family. I dismissed him immediately. I offered his wife and daughter refuge in our house. Within a day, they'd gone back to him. It's not always easy, especially when you think they'll change. This path should take us to the beach. We'll leave the horses to avoid being seen. We should approach with caution. I don't want to put Kajiwara's family at The sad thing is, they probably could be getting murdered. That must be Kajiwara's fishing hut. The Mongols found it. They may have already killed him and his family. There's a chance they're still alive. Let's go. Send your best warrior! Damn it. I'm in their damn flaming swords. At least these are the guys are coming for me first. Now then. Oh. No, not him. Oh. Shot me all the way into the water. I guess he's dead then. Oh no, he's right there. What are you doing here? Come on, come over. You're literally going to die. I 
kill his mind or he must be. Don't see any more Mongols. Let's check the house for Kajiwara and his family. No, dead, definitely. New rolls of cloth. Not cloth. Silk. More than a humble fisherman could afford. Oh, yep. This must be Kajiwara's wife and daughter. I always feared this would be their fate. Maybe the Mongols killed them? Then where is Kajiwada's body? This blade is covered in blood. It doesn't look like a Mongol weapon. It's a fisherman's tool. Mazuko, footprints. Leading away from the hut. What if Kajiwara survived? Ran like a coward. Let's follow the footprints. Wouldn't doubt that he killed his wife and daughter. Kajiwara! Lady Masako! The Mongols attacked! My wife and daughter! Quiet, Snake! We know you killed them. Out of love. Better me than the Mongols. It's what they wanted. You sick Jin! You recruited the assassins who killed my family! Who hired you? Tell me, and I will end you lovingly, like you did your wife and daughter. All I know is, he understood. Understood what? How it feels to be ruined by you. How I was driven to poverty. The toll it took on my family. I couldn't stand to hear another word. Everything he said was a lie. Except about being ruined by me. I know Sadao felt the same way. The conspirators are bonded by hate. The attack on your clan was personal. Organized by a rival samurai with a deep grudge. I can't think of who. You'll find him. Hmm. That's my nobu. Yeah, that's my nobu. That's my nobu. It would have been funny if Jin was like, we could have was, could have gotten more out of him. Yet Jin was literally about to beat the man's ass. I find it funny that Jin sometimes says, you need to control your anger, Lady Masako. Yeah. Yeah, we see him do stuff like this. Like where he actually gets, you know, he keeps getting mad at stuff. More damage. Can I move? So now I think we move on to Norio. Yeah. We'll go do stuff with Norio.